Here are five things women with epilepsy should know about how anti-seizure drugs affect birth control and pregnancy. First, many anti-seizure drugs can make hormonal birth control less effective. This can increase the risk of an unplanned pregnancy. If a woman is taking one of these drugs, better birth control options include an IUD, medroxyprogesterone depot injection, or a birth control pill with at least 30 micrograms of estrogen that is taken every day of the month with a break about every three months. Second, the estrogen in birth control pills and patches can make the anti-seizure drugs lamotrigine and valproate less effective, leading to more seizures. Women may need a higher dose of lamotrigine or valproate to control seizures. Third, all anti-seizure drugs increase the risk of birth defects if taken during pregnancy. The risk is highest with the drug valproate. The risk is also greater when anti-seizure drugs are taken at higher doses and when multiple anti-seizure drugs are used. Fourth, all women with epilepsy who want to become pregnant should plan well ahead. Anti-seizure drugs may need to be changed. Women who are seizure-free for at least nine months before pregnancy are less likely to have seizures during pregnancy. All women taking anti-seizure drugs should take five milligrams of folic acid daily. Finally, it is generally safe to breastfeed while taking most anti-seizure drugs, but watch the baby for poor suck, poor weight gain, drowsiness, and being unusually excitable. It may be necessary to adjust the timing of breastfeeding.